This is the parasternal long axis view in tetralogy of Fallow. Aortic valve is seen in the closed position. You can see the ventricular septal defect which is sub-aortic. And you can see the right to left flow across the interventricular septal defect which is blue in color. It is away from the transducer. This is a patent ductus arteriosus in a case of tetralogy of fallow. You can see the flow into the pulmonary artery which is a continuous flow. This is the CW Doppler, continuous wave Doppler of PDHH. Now we will see what happens after a repair of tetralogy of fallow. You can see a dense patch in the subbiotic region. There is no flow across the patch in this case. That means the repair has been complete. There is no residual ventricular septal defect. This is the M mode echocardiogram and this is the pulmonary regurgitation which is almost invariably seen after repair. M mode of pulmonary valve showing the A wave. This is the pulmonary flow after repair. Good flow. And this is the apical four chamber view showing all four chambers. Now we have a four chamber view showing the tricuspid regurgitation which is persisting. This is the subcostal view showing the intact intratrial septum. Please subscribe to this channel for future updates. Thank you.